to the Center for Global Development. I'm Amanda Glassman. I'm the Director for Global Health Policy here. Um, today we're going to be talking about a quite complex uh, topic, but a really important topic, and that is priority setting using scarce public resources. The Center for Global Development is an independent, nonpartisan think tank that looks at how the policies, products, and practices of high-income countries affect the poor and low- and middle-income countries. And the key reason that we started working in this area is because we're concerned about how governments and global health funders decide how they spend their money and how we could make it easier to buy more health. And I mean, of course, it's not their money. It's taxpayer money. So it's really important that we're achieving Harvey Feinberg and Mirta Roses. And today, first, Dr. Feinberg is going to talk a little bit about the universality of this challenge of resource allocation in healthcare. I'll tell you a little bit about a report that we've just put out from a working group on priority setting institutions. And then Dr. Roses will talk about how the Pan American Health Organization and its member countries are leading the way on working together on priority setting to get more health for the money. So first I'll introduce Dr. Feinberg. He is, doesn't really need a, an introduction because he's the president of the Institute of Medicine, a really unique institution in the U.S. healthcare system. Under his lead, he's dealt with really controversial topics in an incredibly uh, technical and constructive way. The IOM made recommendations to the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services on the design of essential health benefits under the Affordable Care Act. He's been provost of Harvard University between 97 and 2001. He was dean of the Harvard School of Public Health while I studied there for 13 years. He founded and served as president of the Society for Medical Decision Making, which is totally central to the topic we'll talk about today. And once, he even worked as a consultant to the World Health Organization. That's my, we've got five bullets here. That's probably um, one of the amazing, so he's very familiar with our world. So thank you so much, Dr. Feinberg, and I'll look forward to your comments.